one. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of the Little Brown Boys. I am Pancho, and this next to me is Frankie Rosales. Shout out to everybody who's with us. Shout out to the homies that know us personally. Shout out to the homies that know us virtually. Yep, and shout out to everybody that's new. If you're new here, go ahead and leave a like, subscribe, you know. shoot us a comment. Yeah. Let us know what you think, bro. Do you like the vibe that we built? It's a hangout. The Little Brown Boys isn't nothing more or less than just a hangout. Yeah. Where we talk about shit that just grinds our gears. Yeah. <laughs> Come here to fucking just forget about everything yeah. going on and just have a silly yeah. goose time with us. Silly goose. Silly goose. <laughs> Got a list, dog. I know, bro. I, I, Hey, bro. I got to tell you something right now, fool. And I'm a family man now. You know what I mean? I went to Costco and got one. That's how quick I became a like fucking a family. family starter kit. Yeah, like I just bought the package. You know, like you go to a car a car dealership, and you know what? I want a Z seventy one on my. Shit. That's how I went and got a family. But I just experienced what is now a thing. It's a huge thing because it's been it's been happening now. Like it's been happening for a long time, but now it's a thing. You know, pumpkin patches. When the fuck in your life have you gone to a fucking pumpkin patch? I've been to a pumpkin patch. When you were a kid? Yeah. Well, as a kid, now. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? That's what I'm talking about. Your kid, Infancia, way, your Infancia is from 5 to 13. Ya a los 14, ponte trabajar. Yeah, yes, yes. yes. You You buy your own birthday present. Yeah, exactly. But you went to a crazy pumpkin (laughs) patch. Yeah, for an hour and a half away. Damn. What was city or what? Redlands, bro. Redlands. I've never in my oh, life, in my life. never in my life. That's all the way the fuck out there. Yeah, way the fuck out a there. La quinta. Yeah, hasta la, hasta la quinta, bro. Yeah, yeah, it was la far. Quinta, ver. <laughs> but, <laughs> but it was such a fucking crazy fool. First of all, I, I, I prepared from, like I said, now that I'm a family man, bro. You got to look at the weather. You got to look at, okay, what are we? You got to look at it as a like a, like you're you're about to experience a fucking NFL game. What's the weather like? What terrain are we on? Um, humidity levels. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So I was like, okay, it's going to be 88 degrees the whole fucking day, bro. I can fuck about your pumpkin patch picture. You know what I mean? Yeah. I'm wearing sporting hiking boots yeah. and short shorts yeah. and, a, and a fire-ass t-shirt where I'm comfortable. Yeah, you're going to the Redlands. Yeah. So that's fucking, like, you know what I'm saying? Desert, no? Yeah. Like and then I saw so many fools in flannels. Okay, yeah. It's sweating fall. It's a fall. brick, bro. It's fall. Yeah. It's fall. <laughs> hey, wait. I saw so many fools sufriendo, wey. Yeah. Like, just sufriendo, compa. Like, pushing the stroller. They're all the pomade. The pomade Ooh, on the hair. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was white on their forehead. Oh, you know what I mean? Yeah. I was like, that's what you get, you dumbass. Yeah, should have worn shorts. Yeah. Sometimes, fool. You got to tell your lady, size kid, nah, you're tripping. Yeah, you know yeah, I mean? yeah, yeah. But I saw a lot of I, I saw a lot of uh, viejas in their botas, way. Yeah, of course. It's yeah, fall. the it's fucking fall. the the botas <laughs> with the spandex or the the leggings. Yeah, and the fucking maquillaje was was heavy. So it was, it was hotter than what you expected, yeah, or, or it was... it's it's October twenty one. Yeah. At this point, you know, I think Greta Thurm- Thornburg yeah. had a point. Low key, low key, bro, yeah, yeah, because. Yeah. It's supposed to start to get crispy, you know, a little chilly, yeah, out, but not. You're not. supposed to see the little smoke. Yeah. The little smoke. Once five o'clock comes, the little smoke, like, oh, wait, ya, ya yeah. prende el pinche fuego, compa. You know what I mean? But no, fool, it was like, yo, hit me with some fucking water gun. Yeah. It was like the summer, like the fair. Yeah, fool, it legit, it was a fair. So I went to the Live Oak uh, pumpkin patch. I had a blast. Don't get it twisted. I had a blast, but I love seeing people. Uh, be neglectful, yeah, and just for the pick, for anything for the pick at this right, point, right? Of course, you know what I mean. For the Instagram, and I thought that shit was so much fun, bro. Like watching these people suffer. I saw a kid get smacked so hard, bro. Oh yeah, and you I thought it was okay. It. Yeah, I thought it was okay. So what was he doing? Everyone was reaction. Yeah, he was. Set he, it up for me because okay. I can't just imagine a kid got hit. Okay, oh, okay, all right, right, right. My bad, my bad, my fault. Because I get so excited when kids get hit. Yeah, I get, bro. I follow a page called. Kids getting hurt. Oh, and okay. it makes my day. Yeah? So, <laughs> we're at the car- carousel way. Okay. The carousel. All right. right. Is that a Ferris wheel? The fair- no, that's the little merry-go-round. Whatever. Car- yeah. <laughs> carousel is merry-go-round, by, by okay. the way. 
we're at we're there. Obviously, there's a line. Food. There's kids waiting, and and there's kids that don't have self control. That's where the parents come in. Mm -hmm. You know, you gotta mm -hmm. teach. Hey, relax. Yeah, it's your turn's coming soon. This little kid came in like he was like. Like rampaging through the fucking line, just like wanting to get on the fucking horses, which is fine. I was waiting for the parent to just, the mom came and she was like, hey, smack them across the head, bro. Like, hey, let's just see there's a line. And I was like, yes. <laughs> I was like, yeah, there you go, yeah. motherfucker. Teaching her respect. Yeah. Nice. Okay. It's about that. And I was like, you know what? It's all right. It's we're at the brink of World War Three right now. It took and no everyone's reactions was acceptable. Some people looked away. I was making eye contact. Clapping with the, low key. I was little golf clap. I was like, let's fucking go, bro. Usted dígale, señora. Yeah. Usted dígale. Let's fucking go, dude. And I was like, was he like the only child or did he have siblings around? Yeah, he had siblings, bro. Yeah, there was okay. another one in the stroller, you know what I mean? And even the little kid in the stroller was like, hey, that's what you get, dog. Yeah. Because it's should have stayed in the stroller, bro. Yeah, just relax a little bit. You yeah. feel me? He was too excited. Too excited, bro. And then it made me, like, civilization still has a chance right now. Mm. I seen that uh, they had, like, roller coasters yeah. and fucking McFlurry machines. Yeah, bro. And fucking turkey time legs. tellers. And turkey legs in the yeah. middle of the fucking mountain. So it was more than a pumpkin patch. Yeah, It bro. was like a fair. It was literally like that a petting zoo. The L.A. County Fair in the mountain. Okay. With pumpkins. That's it. What was like the main attraction? Corn maze, bro. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you about that. It's shit. a real maze? It's a real fucking, it's huge. Okay. It's huge. You get in there and you're like, oh, piece, your fucking confidence level yeah, is you think so it's bullshit. It's bullshit. You're at a kid's thing, like a kid's party. You're, you're Compa, like, it's a corn maze, big yeah, dog. Yeah. It's big as fuck. Yeah. And it's like, you're going to get it's lost. Tall. Yeah. And then there was, there was, you can see the the there's evidence of desperation. Okay. Someone tore down a section. Yeah, yeah. Just you, went through. <laughs> just went Hell through. yeah. Fuck and this shit. I got there's it. like a caution tape, like like, oh, this is still the more the, the maze. Oh, but yeah. just ignore this. Yeah, ignore the hole. <laughs> ignore the hole. Yo, fool. I was straight up like, we're stuck here forever. Yeah. We're stuck here forever. Immediately, fool, like five minutes into getting like into the maze, I started eating the corn. Yeah, I was like, yo, I'm ripping some of these corns, and I'm I, and I started eating it, fool. I was like, fuck this shit, we're lost. Yeah, that's it. Someone else, see Leo. Yeah, There's they don't have like guides. Nothing, fool. Like, it's just a, with, like, it's just like pieces. enter at your own risk. Right, okay, though? damn. And which was what makes it fun, but at the same time. There's autistic people out here. Right. Or you what know? if you get lost in the maze and you got to take a shit, bro? Stereo. And then that's what happened to some people, bro. So there was some, I saw a girl pop a squat. Okay. You yeah. Know? She, Usually when, when you go on, like, when you go to these big hikes, when you get a permit, they give you a bag so that if you need to take a shit, you shit in the bag right. and you carry your shit down with you so yeah. that you don't leave shit up there. They should do that for the corn maze. The longest. What if you're halfway and you got to take a shit? Yeah, you're not gonna shit in the middle of the corn maze. Yeah, you ate fucking chili cheese fries. That's why that guy made the hole in the fucking way because he had a fucking shit. Bro. Or put a porter potty or something. And then they have a reference point, a pole. Oh, I thought the... you were gonna say they're gonna have a referee. No, <laughs> they should. Low key, it's halftime. Everybody take a break. <laughs> Let's look at this instant replay. They should put concession stands in there yeah. because there was some food. The longest time was two hours. No way. Yeah, he was stuck in there for two for hours. Two hours, big dog. And then we did it probably like in thirty we, because we had to like. We really, we had a huddle. Okay. As a unit. Even my little baby girl, she was like, no, we already went that way. Okay. You know? Teamwork. Teamwork. So we were like, all right, let's put a little note every time we bend the corner and it's not that way. Let's right. put a little note. You break a branch. <laughs> yeah. Like bro. you're in the fucking woods. I was leaving fucking corn husks. Yeah. <laughs> you know? Yeah. And then fucking, we get to the to the point where it's like the easy way out. Mm -hmm. Like they they give you the option. You can either keep going. Like a little cheater. A little, like this like is. Cheat, cheat. This is it, big dog. This is your exit, your moment. Mm -hmm. Either you take this easy way out or you can continue and be a bad motherfucker yeah. and figure it out. Fool. The easy way out is is right here and the real exit is right here. Like right around it? Right around it. What a piece of shit maze guy. Yeah. You know? So it was like real corn in the ground? Yeah, fool. It was, I fucking ate some corn, bro. So you probably, I'll, I'll insert a picture so you can see it. They take a, like, they take care of it all year round. All year round. For this pumpkin patch yes. event. Yes. Just and for fools to show up in flannels. 
and just be hot and mad. And, and mad. <laughs> yeah. Hell yeah, because there was uh, UFC last yesterday. Oh yeah, <laughs> well, I was the I was I had like five dads around me. Yeah, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was the guy with the with link. The fo- yeah, with the link in the phone, and they were like, "Yeah, bro, I got money." I'm like, "Fuck yeah, yeah, let me see, let me see what y'all hold on, let me see." Do they have like those carnival games where you pay like thirty bucks for like, three shots? Yeah, and then they give you a yeah. We shot pump- as- we shot pumpkins at like uh, Yonkers. Okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah that's oh, right, yeah, 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 yeah. I went to this little uh, carnival thing that they did at like St. John Bosco over there in Bellflower. And we went, and um, there was this one where, where they give you baseballs. And right. They have like fucking glass bottles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we're just walking around, and and I'm not really trying to play the games because I'm like, ah, it's whatever, you know, it's for the kids. And then my ego got struck a little bit because some fool was picking up the baseballs that like the failed attempts. Yeah. And he looks at me while he's picking up. He's like, "What's well, so up? You gonna play or what?" <laughs> And, and I wanted to be like, yeah, fool, what's up? Like, like, shoot me what's three, up, run, shoot me three, run, run, it. run it, bro, what's up? But I was like, nah, chill, chill, chill. Yeah, this yeah, fool's yeah. gonna get me right now. Like, he almost got me, fool, because the way he looked at it, he was like, what's up? Yeah, <laughs> you know, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm good, bro. Just, it was all, yeah, it's pretty, it's practically all carnies, yeah, really, this shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah fool, there's some fool that doing face paint. He looked so much like a meth head. Okay. That was nuts, bro. And he was like, oh, yeah, me and my brother were doing balloons and, and face paint. And I was just like, you shouldn't be touching kids. <laughs> you shouldn't be touching yeah, kids, yeah. guy. Why do your fingers look like that? Yeah, bro. fool. <laughs> oh my god, it was bad, bro. But then, like, um, I saw that that a lot of families were having fun, fool. Of course. But is it worth it? I don't know. I mean, it depends. Did the Instagram picture come out right? Or, you know what I mean? Or what? Because that's what it comes down to, right? Yeah, fool. Nah. And it's a bunch of raunchy ass fucking. Creída gente, güey, que no le, like, the balloon guy. We gave him a tip. Well, here's 10 bucks, big dog. Gracias. You know okay. what I mean? Good looking now. Good looking now for, for paying, your... you know, and he got down. And then, uh, thank you for making the balloon. But there was this one lady, bro, she straight cut the line and then brought seven fucking kids and bra, bra, and no tip, bro. Damn. Fucking desgraciada, güey. She just was like, like a, like a, Raza or yeah, of course yeah. she was. Fool, she was from fucking HP for sure. Oh, all right, for right. sure. The she, boots, the boots set it off. Oh, she had the boots on. Yeah. For some reason, I was picturing stroller, like sandals. The stroller. Oh, let me tell you. Yeah, <laughs> there was people in sandals in that bitch. <laughs> that was the dirt. Yeah, their feet look like immigrant feet okay. for sure. They're ready straight. for that maze, bro. Yeah, <laughs> that maze ain't shit. <laughs> Fuck around. Fool. They've been training forever. Bro. Oh, that was wild, bro. Watching these fucking people just be fucking desgraciados. I was like, yo, you guys have no shame. And I don't give a fuck. We just don't be that person. Tip tip the server what it needs to be. Yeah. And by the way, I also went to a high-end restaurant recently. And they fucking in by, by Melrose. That waitress took forever to take her. And then had the nerve to put on the fucking, like, like the, the tab was like, what, 500 bucks? The fucking tip. Eighteen dollars or eighteen percent tip was like eighty dollars or something. God like that. damn, bitch! You get fifteen bucks from me. <laughs> I paid the tap. I was okay. like, "This is fifteen bucks for you." Yeah, that's yeah, yeah. what you get, dog. Not eighty. I don't believe in this tip culture that no? we're living in. Fuck no, fool. <laughs> bitch, you're getting paid a salary to do your job. Right, right, right. If you want to go above and beyond, let me help. You know who treats me better? The guy who windshield windshield wipes my fucking shit at Arco. Yeah, yeah. That yeah. food, hey, boss. How you doing, boss? I'm gonna I'm gonna do you like that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm gonna clean your windows. Here's 10 bucks, big dog. Yeah. I know you need that. Right, right. right. You know, but this fucking bitch that's act, an acting school. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And she's waiting here and you fucking made me wait 45 minutes for two margaritas. Fuck off. Charles. Bitch. Yeah. And don't they include it sometimes? And they give and on top of that, a four percent charge. Bro. Yeah, of course. Oh, uh, uh, they were cold. Uh, keep uh yeah. Keep the the homies healthy, charge. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is you got our drinking fuck. habit. Yeah, fuck you, dog. That's crazy. Serio, fool. I don't believe in that shit. The pumpkin patch was cool. I don't believe in it either. I but I still did it because you know. Did you guys get a pumpkin? Not one. Isn't that the point? I tried to steal one though. I legit tried to steal <laughs> like, one. Okay. I like a big one. Oh. Fuck. I had it in my sh- like a I had it in my shoulder like a yelera. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they were like, "Sir, sir," and I was like, "What? What? Like what?" And they were like, you have to pay for that. It's a pumpkin patch. I paid to get in. Oh, okay. I paid to get out. What? It's like a, when you go to a quinceañera, you take yeah, the present. The, the you, recuerdo. Take, you take the fucking centerpiece. 
<laughs> yeah, but they caught my ass, and then I just bought a soda. But, but yeah, yeah that's the whole point of a pumpkin patch is to go get a pumpkin, take it home, carve it, put a candle in it, put it outside. Yeah. Spooky. Yeah, we already got hit with the make a Halloween episode challenge, bro. I don't want to do that shit, bro. Where I'm I almost born... forgot it was Halloween. Yeah, fool. I'm like, I can't wait till you. You're going to be that 88 degree flannel fucker. You think so? Yeah, fool. <laughs> Why you pick a booger? <laughs> I feel like I got boogers, fool. But nah, I'll go to a pumpkin patch, but I'll dress You're accordingly. You're not that gay? Bro. You're not that gay, like, for the picture? You're First not... of all, I got, like, one flannel. <laughs> First, let's just put that out there. I got like one flannel that you wore and, last episode. Yeah, and 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 nothing to match with it. So <laughs> there goes that. Yeah. But I I'm very proud of you because you prepared. Yeah. And fool. I'm a big preparer. Yeah. No fool. I went straight. Fu- I went full fucking. Uh, like what will Pancho do right now? He'll check the weather. He look for his shorts. He'll fucking get a hat. I had a, I had a knife. Yeah. You know a what I mean? Knife and uh, liquid IV in my pocket. Just yeah. In case. But the funniest thing to me was the corn rate. So immediately I started eating the corn. <laughs> Were they selling beer? Yeah. That's I, a real pumpkin patch. Though. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling you, bro. I got fucked up. At I was, the pumpkin patch. Yeah. I was fuck. I was being a that real like pumpkin fun. asshole. Sounds like fun. <laughs> yeah. And you were there all day? Yeah, all day, bro. Nice, nice. But shout out to everybody who's uh in this fall spirits a huevo. And shout out to my mans out there that have to be, hey, bro, make the best out of it. You yeah. know? Yeah. Just make the best out of it. That's all I can say. La carito. But for sure, you're going to have fun too, bro. Hey, it took me a while to have fun. It took me a while to be like, look at this dumbass bitch. You I know, you. <laughs> you know yeah. what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. To leave all your fucking. All that bullshit. Your prejudices and your, and your, and your expectations yeah. and fucking yeah, I bought a six pack on the way nice you know what I mean a little fucking DUI it doesn't hurt <laughs> <laughs> well we're going to pumpkin patch hey Ossifer Ossifer I have fun at pumpkin patch <laughs> the main <laughs> but yeah fool, what happened dog let's talk about some other crazy shit that's happening out in the world bro well that's- shit the, the, wor- the worst thing you can do other than going to a pumpkin patch is Go to an NFL game nowadays. I heard. Fucking last week when the Chargers and the Cowboys played a crazy ass fight ensued. And it, it got me thinking because ever since I started getting really into the UFC and I got boxing gloves, I go to the gym, I hit the bag. You know what I mean? I do a couple of like this? I do a couple of footwork like drills this? and shit. And, and I swear I could get down, fool. Last time I fought was when I was 18. And that's fucking like. 13 years ago. And you just got one swing in. Just- yeah, and I got my ass beat. <laughs> and, and it changes, fool, because if you go to somewhere, rules don't apply. Yeah. Like, first of all, there was full slipping. So imagine trying to get down and you're, like, slipping, bro. Right, That's just right, scary. Right. And then what if somebody comes and just kicks you in the head, bro? Yeah, fool. It's crazy. What if... I seen this thing on, the, on, on Instagram. I thought it was hilarious because there was this girl got her man uh, tickets to go look, watch the Broncos play for his birthday. And the Broncos got their ass beat. <laughs> like, it's a, it's a good thought, right? Yeah. It's a good present, you know, to think, like, oh, look, I got your tickets to see your favorite game. But then you go and your team gets demolished. Bro. Right, right, right. That's probably worse than than not getting anything. Right. But I think right now with how, like, the NFL is going, bro, they're just causing a ruckus. These fucking tailgating. Yeah, like, fool. Yeah, fool. Fucked up, dog. Yeah. You do not need. Tw- what are you in the military <laughs> of drinking? To wake up at four hundred under <laughs> or four hundred hours and fucking fireball shot that bitch. Oh no, yeah, fucking. You know? homie was telling us about how they how they go to the tailgate at like at three in the morning, nah. so that they can like reserve the spot. You know, start setting up the fucking shade. The, the Traeger grill. Yeah. You got to wake up at 3 a.m. Tactical know, gear. Get like there. Fucking, you got there. You got seven shotgun beers right here next to your chest. Food, throw a fucking grenade, buzz ball. You know what I'm saying? Like, what is going on, bro? And then you got to work you, tomorrow. And then you got to go. Bro, you got to go to work tomorrow. No, and, that's got to be the worst. Food. You wake up at 3 a.m. Yeah. Right? You go set up a fucking tailgate party, right? You're... Faded, drunk by 7 a.m. Your team doesn't play till 1. Yeah. You take a nap. <laughs> you wake up hungover already. You try to rally. You Uber eats menudo. <laughs> yeah. You, you you try to get back on the party, but you're like already like headache, you know? Yeah. You go into the game. 
your team loses. And then you go to the restroom, someone passes you a little bolsita. Yeah, and now you think you're the hardest now shit you're ever. Now you're the hardest shit ever, bro. And you end up getting your ass beat. Yeah. Because someone, you ate somebody's hot dog. <laughs> And and now like you're missing half your jaw, <laughs> yeah. Because someone then, kicked you. And then you're at, you're on Monday at the office, like, oh, I, I got in a car accident. Yeah, <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> like, what? What were what, you what, in the what? World Trade Center eleven <laughs> years ago or what? Twenty one years ago? What happened, Big Dog? Did you fucking get? Uh, did you find Bigfoot? <laughs> and, and your team lost, bro. And your team lost. Yeah. The NFL right now is literally like the fucking worst experience. The fool that broke your jaw was rooting for the same team. You should have got. <laughs> you guys were both Charger fans. And that fool fucked up your jaw. And the Chargers still lost. And your lady cheated on you. Yeah. You can't find her right now, actually. You're in the hospital <laughs> with a broken jaw and you, she, her phone's off. Yo, NFL fans are the worst, She's bro. with a Cowboy fan right I now. Tried, I tried not to even go watch NFL in public. Honestly. Or just don't wear any gear. Just yeah. go as a civilian. Yeah. Oh, what is it? Who's playing? I, I'm, I'm, I'm wearing a Chivas jersey yeah. at the fucking... Yeah, there you go. <laughs> at Buffalo Wild Wings. Just, <laughs> just shut up. No, nothing. but for real, we should have gone to the pumpkin patch, big dog. Yeah. What's more, what's more worse? Getting your fucking ass handed to you because you're rooting for another man, other, other men in another team, which is gay as fuck, by the way. Yeah. Or going to the pumpkin patch and and being hot. I really go to the pumpkin patch. Yeah, being hot in that flannel, and and sacrificing a little bit of your body heat. You know, I'll yeah. go and I'll, I'll tear the sleeves off the flannel. <laughs> Straight up, ready to ball up. <laughs> <laughs> like a like a fucking Joe Dirt. Hell yeah, bro! I'll fuck it, right? With a little uh, mist gun, you know, like, like, with a fan. Is the water with the fan? Yo. <laughs> Yeah, Watching so, the game on my phone. Dude. Serio, 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 it's serio. Sitting in the cafeteria. That was me. That was me, fool. I was wearing my fucking, uh, my hiking shoes. And I, you couldn't tell me shit, bro. I had my talk can. I had my cell phone. I was like, yo, I, la estoy mirando aquí. No se preocupen. I'm watching her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Relax. I got the, I, I got two eyes. Yeah. One on the game and one on her. Mm-hmm. I'm my baby. Don't trip. I'm, I got her. You know? You gotta, you gotta use your resources. Resources, big dog. Wherever I'm at, I'm always going to enjoy my sports because I got the link. True. You know what I mean? Yep, yep. You, I, I was watching, Um, I don't know, do you care about VPNs and shit like that? Nah, fool. They can find me. I give a fuck. What are you going to tell me? Fuck it, huh? Yeah, just blue. Hey, we're not what putting up? you over because you're faded. We're putting you over because you've been using the fucking yeah. link. Who's winning? <laughs> I'm trying to see. Let me see. <laughs> blue. Yeah. Hey, soon enough, bro. <laughs> <They pull up. laughs> They pull up on you just to see the score real quick. Just like they just raid your house. Like, fuck, I stopped trapping a long time ago. Yeah, yeah. No, let me see. What quarter is it? <laughs> yeah. shout, out, shout out the link. You know, Sh- the shout, link out, shout out the uh, FBI who's cracking down on LimeWire users. Yeah. Still. I think I'm, I know more about the UFC in Spanish than I do in English. <laughs> because at home, my shit's Spanish. The, the link that I always get, it's always in Spanish. And it doesn't freeze. So I'm like, fuck, I watch it in Spanish, bro. That's so That's the sick as the rumbo right there. <laughs> and the tercer asalto, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, bro. Shout out to shout out to ladies too. Shout out to girlfriends and, and shout out to our, our women audience who who take it uh step. Who understands that UFC is dope. No, <laughs> who understand that like, you know, your man is like is present, he's there, and that's enough. Because mentally he's like at the game. Yeah. Or he's at the sport that he likes. Like I was saying, fool, I was at the pumpkin patch, present. Right. Here's my fucking card. Yeah. Go get her whatever the fuck she wants. But I'm paying attention to this because I got ga- I got money on this fucking right, fight. Right, right, right. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And like, shout out to them, bro. And I know it's annoying. It's not all the time. Also, as a man, you got to keep your balance. You know? Not every fucking UFC you have to put money on. Right. Not every uh, boxing match. Not every... Uh, unless you're that guy who's making that dough. Yeah. You know what I mean? yeah, yeah. yeah. Unless you're a bookie. Yeah, fool. Like, what's up for? Are you a bookie? Yeah, serio. But yeah, shout out to all our women out there that are putting it down for their husbands or, or boyfriends. You guys are a pillar of our lives. Yes. You know what pillar. I mean? Pillar. Fucking. Yeah, that, that reminds me of a question I wanted to ask you. Well, you know how we have our things that we like to do, you know? Yeah, Shit yeah, that yeah. makes us comfy, you know? Foods you like to eat. You know, just things. That you like. If you had, if you were stuck mm-hmm. in one loop, Right, you do that. You're doing this thing, it, like a little activity or like something, but it's a loop. It starts over and over. 
for eternal life, what would it be? Fuck. For sure, eating. Eating something? Eating something. If it has no effect on me? I mean, I think the process of a carne asada. Okay. Like, like going to get the meat. Putting it on the grill. Then the sides. And then making the taco. And then eating it. And then chilling and watching TV. And then starting, starting over. <laughs> okay. All right. I, I fuck with that. Yeah. That so would like be... a cool little Saturday. Yeah. A fire Saturday. Carne asada Saturday. 80, 88 degrees, no fa- flannel. Okay. You know? I like that. I like that. I like that. 88 degrees, no flannel. See, that should be degree. the name of your mixtape. Yeah. 88 degrees, no flannel. That's the name of this episode. Hell yeah. <laughs> I like that. But yeah, that's what I would do. Just to rip. Boo, you know how exciting it is to go get the meat. Stand in line. And then, oh, then it. Tres libras de rachera preparada pasar. Right, right. And then they start, oh, preparada? Preparada, compa. Yeah. Oh, you're getting down? You're getting down. Yeah. You know what's crazy? It's the little brown boys and everything, but when I was a kid and I would go to the market, to the carniceria, the carnicero always called me güero. Oh, güero? Yeah, because he didn't know my name. But right, he was right. like, ¿con qué te ayudamos, güero? You yeah, know, like yeah. that? That's and I thought I was cool because I thought, oh, this would give me a nickname, dog, but I'm sure... He called everybody well, yeah. or or que no moreno or something. You yeah, know? you gotta go to the carniceria with the fucking the mural of the cow that they just killed. Yeah, then you stare at the pig feet because it looks crazy, <laughs> <laughs> or like the fucking pig eye that's just like yeah, yeah, yeah that's You're just like, like oh this. shit, oh, hey. that you think you think you think uh, it felt when yeah. it died, yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. <laughs> or, or I remember at Superior they had the live fish, the catfish. Oh yeah, you they fuck with it. They were alive, bro. I used to always go check them out. Yeah, like, yeah. Oh shit, there's only three today. Yeah, definitely, bro. Where's the other three? <laughs> <laughs> why are they even here? <laughs> why is there? Why is this one missing a whole fucking yeah, whisker? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, but you're right, fool. Like that's the best, bro. That's to me. So that would you, be it, your eternal loop. Yeah, fool. That's heaven. To me. I got you. You know what I mean? My eternal loop would be a carne asada mov- movimiento. Way. I get you. That's my next uh, LP, by the way. My fucking carne asada movimiento. Yeah. They say, they say, well, I saw this question or something when they were like, how to fucking skip small talk and start. Or, yeah, or get to the how point. Do, how do, you can tell a lot about a person by this question. Like oh, what kind of person they yeah, are. Yeah, I'm here for a good time, not question. a long time, big dog. <laughs> I'm here yeah. for a good time. Yeah. So don't invite me to your NFL fucking uh, tailgate because I'll fall asleep, bro. Yeah. yeah. I will I'll fall asleep. another sport on my phone. <laughs> I'll fall asleep, dog, and you'll miss me, dog. And then don't expect me to jump in when you're getting down with some other fucking cowgirl. Yeah, no, nah, I'm good. I will not jump in. I will not jump in. I'll make fun of you. I'll stand on the wall so nothing comes behind me. That's funny, my eternal man. loop. I'll probably do something satisfying. Like, you know those YouTube videos, like, satisfying to go to sleep type shit? Uh-huh. That I'll, I'll probably be like a window cleaner, like on a skyscraper. You know how they have the, the like, soap and they have the squeegee shit and they just, like, squeegeeing that shit? I think that's what I would be doing. You're a fucking serial killer. Why? Because I for like sure. squeegees? Because you're fucking crazy for that one, bro. What? You're supposed to enjoy your eternal loop. Well, because I don't want to fucking stuff my face. Because <laughs> I want to, I want people to enjoy their view. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's cynical as fuck. What, washing windows? Yes, food. That's your eternal loop for yeah, the rest. It's satisfying. Damn, that's crazy. Bro, you're Play going. Tre- Play Tetris. Nah, whack. All right, then. You want to fucking saturate yourself with sodium. All day, every day. <laughs> <laughs> All day, every day. <laughs> that's crazy. Or, or like cutting soap or something. You ever see those videos where they cut soap? I had an ex-girlfriend one time. That used to cut soap? That used to cut soap. That's crazy. For her anxiety. I've never done it, but I like watching it. I used to be like, let me get that. Let me get that. Let me wash my car. <laughs> let me get that. Or you know which one <laughs> Just too? Just throw it in the, the bucket like that. <laughs> the fucking, the shit that, that destroys shit. It's like two rollers. Oh my God. And it's you metal and you're, they throw metal on top of it. You're crazy, fool. You're crazy. That you're shit is my crazy. favorite. You're fucking crazy, Pancho, and I can't look at you right now because you're fucking crazy, fool. If that is what you enjoy. Yeah, I want to be the operator. Oh, my God, fool. You're autistic. Like a stroller? Yeah, throw it in there. Yeah. <laughs> Just a stroller busy yeah. the leg. Yeah, a watermelon. Throw it in there. Live chicken. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, throw it in there. <laughs> yeah, I want to be that operator, fool. I want to throw shit in crazy, there. You're crazy, bro. You don't, you've seen those videos, right? Yeah, I have. 
The best one, it. the best one is where they throw like a compressor, like an old compressor old, body, like yeah. a vessel. And it's yeah, and, yeah. Like, and it, it's not working. It's like just bouncing around. Some fool grabs it. And it's like no, you're gonna go in. <laughs> I want to be that guy. That's that's literally what I saw yesterday. Like just fools. No, you're gonna go to this pumpkin. Patch. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> they're just like wow. it's just the female, you know. But it's fine. I went in. I got my ass simulated. Yeah, yeah, I got at the pumpkin patch. Yeah, yeah, they. And then once I got present, once I was present, they didn't even want me there no more. Yeah, they were like, "Get this fucker out of here!" (laughs) He's eating all the corn. (laughs) (laughs) I thought the goats were over there. Yeah, (laughs) like this is not a goat. This is this is the petting zoo. This is Frankie Rosales. (laughs) (laughs) Well, he chews like a goat. He's fucking chewing. (laughs) Fuck you! If you made it this far, guess what? It's UFC talk, big dog. So, there was a big fight, fool. Huge fight. 10 days notice, Volkanovski versus fucking Islam. Makashev. Yeah, that fool. Hey, bro. They should have Islam at the pumpkin patch wrestling all the fucking animals there. Because that's how crazy this fool is. That shit was wild to me to watch this fucking fight. And like I was saying earlier, I was watching the fight on my phone and I had like gathered dads around me. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know? And yeah. they were all talking about their bets. And it's crazy oh, they were talking see, about bets? Yeah, it's crazy to see how much money is in this shit. I put 10 bucks. Did you tell them about your bets? Yeah. What'd they say? And they thought I was insane. <laughs> this was said bulk by sub. <laughs> that, that's crazy, bro. <laughs> because, the, hey, fool, fuck it, fool. If I'm going to put money up, let me get the craziest fucking odd. <laughs> I had like... And I've had hit before. I know, I know. I, I Hey, we we said that already. <coughs> I put like thirty different bets, and I had to do math at the end. I'm up fifteen bucks, so shout out me. Yeah, I I I put all kind of bets, but that that fight card bro was so it, wild. It was so weird. It was weird. Yeah. It, was, it had weird vibes all around from the two main events or yeah. the two main fights yeah. being short notice fights. Yeah, that's already like what the fuck's going on here. We had to, I put an alarm at six fifty a.m. To watch these fights yeah, because I wanted bro. to make a cafecito, you know. Yeah. So that was weird, you know. I never yeah. do that. I, yeah, I yeah, couldn't yeah. believe that I was setting an alarm for this shit. I was up at six in the morning too, dog. And then all these fucking fouls, the fucking oh, all I did, the I, nut shots. I wanted to bring that up, bro. The amount of fools that didn't think, like, didn't it felt like they didn't even know their sport, right? The yeah, fucking yeah, yeah. nut shots, the knees Knee, to the head, the knees to the head. The fucking hey wait hey 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 what the fuck hey what the fuck fool? Yeah, the doctor yeah was crazy bro. the that doctor was, yeah. hey fool shout out to Johnny Walker bro. yeah hold on hold on we'll get to Johnny God. Walker shout out to Victor Henry from Southgate <laughs> oh yeah that fool bro. from Southgate in Abu Dhabi and pretending getting down. <laughs> that fool was getting down that fight was it was getting good and then and then he got his that he got his nuts beat yeah fool but like the fucking hey wait. Know this? The the act the act out was fire. And then the 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 doctor being like, nah, he didn't hit you in the nuts. Nah. He was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker, what? That who's was the, crazy. Whose nuts are these? That Yours doctor was crazy, bro. And yeah, then that, Johnny Walker. And Johnny Walker, the, Johnny Walker, bro. He was so fucking prendido logs. Yeah. He was prendido logs, big dog. He wanted to fight Dana White. Yeah. In the fucking... He was like, what's up, dog? What's up, then, What's folk? up, then, homie? You don't yeah. let me get down or what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That shit was so funny, bro. I put money on him just because he's goofy. Like, just because he's, he's a he's fool. A, yeah, he's he's a foolie. You know, and that fool walked out trying to pop lock. <laughs> I thought that was hilarious. And then... And then... So that doctor, right? That fucking doctor got on my nerves so much, yeah, bro, because bro. he called off the fight because Johnny Walker got kneed in the face while he was down. And Johnny Walker's Brazilian. Simon. So his first language is Brazilian or right. Portuguese, whatever they talk. Bra- Brazilian. And he like he knows English, but not like crazy yeah. good, right? And he just got where, hit in the head. Yeah, and he's telling him, where are you right now? Where are you? And he was like, let's fucking go. I, I, yeah, yeah. He's like, yeah. <laughs> Where are Which, you? And like, he's just like, yeah. 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 What's up? And, and Twitter is crazy because they, they go, Johnny Walker's the only fool that that doesn't know where he's at, but he's good to fight. <laughs> you know what I mean? And the doctor asked him, where are you? And somebody said, he said the desert. Like, yeah. I'm in the desert. That's, like, just, that's good enough. That's, to me, 
Arre. Let him Let's get down, fucking okay. go, bro. Yeah. Like, where are you? I'm here to fight. If he would have said, in, in, in mi fucking país, yeah. he would have said Brazil, or if he would have said, I'm at, I'm at fucking Vegas. Yeah. That yeah. doctor was crazy, bro. If you would have said something weird, right? Like, right. oh, I'm in Vegas. I'm at the I'm sphere. In, yeah. I'm at the sphere. <laughs> like, I'm here. Yeah. What the fuck are you talking about? Let's so go. he probably didn't know what he was saying. So he was just like, yeah. Yeah. Like, just trying to like, yeah, get out of here. That that shit was, and then when when they called up the fight, he was like he pushed the rev. That shit was crazy. Yeah, and then all this was going down while I was waiting in line for the carousel. So think about me, bro. I was corning like, your teeth. Yeah, and then I seen a kid get sm- fool. My ambiance was crazy. Yeah, fool. I saw a kid get smacked in the face by his mom. Overload. Yeah, simulation over yeah, or I was stimulation. Like, oh shit, cuz. Yeah, and then I had to go on a maze right after. You know, man, that's that must suck for Johnny Walker, bro. Imagine you do your whole fight camp, see, right? Man. You do the weight cut, yeah. Well, but even before the weight cut, you fly from Brazil or wherever he trains at. Doesn't matter. You're still going to Abu Dhabi. Yeah. That's that's across that's the pond. Eight, that's twenty four hour flight. Yeah, and, and and then just to be like, nah, you can't fight right now. <sighs> Fuck that. Kill me. Fuck that. Fucking. Fuck that. Fucking. Let's run it outside. Cause <laughs> nah. I'm going to get down. <laughs> Fuck that. I need something. And you know what the funniest thing is? I asked you, uh, imagine what the locker room is like. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> You're like, it smells like shit. It smells like <laughs> shit in those locker rooms. Well, there's no way it smells good in there. Nah, there's it no It smells way. like vaporu and, and, and just and straight ass. arnica and yeah. fucking culo wango. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Just, just Indian it food. It literally smells like the Southgate LA Fitness. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> they still got carpet on the floor. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> that, that, that's like 30 years of fucking lost weight. <laughs> yeah. yeah fool. That's you from 1999 <laughs> on the floor. Imagine if they took all the carpet out <laughs> and, they, and they fucking ringed it if they did this. That's crazy. That's what I fucking said. That's you from 1999. Yeah. Your DNA is still here. Oh, shit. Yeah. Um, yeah, but they could catch murderers in that bitch. Like, yeah. yo. DNA. Yeah, DNA. Straight up. Like, in there. Like, the guy that we thought that killed your dad didn't kill him. Yeah. It was right here. I the could coach. See a ne- the I coach. Could, <laughs> yeah, I could see a Netflix. Like, <laughs> LA Fitness. It was the coach the whole time. Phantom of the Fitness. <laughs> or whatever. <laughs> yeah, or 24 hours. Yo, cuz. Oh, 24 hours in 24 hours. Uh, yeah. You know what I mean? Like, something crazy like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah, bro, let's get the fuck out of here, bro, because uh, I think we overloaded our audience. No There's stimulations? Yeah. And shout out to you guys for enjoying the clip so far. It's been great coming back. And um, shout out to you, like I said earlier, shout out to you if you know us personally. Shout out to you if you know us virtually. We're here. We're for the gang. You already know what it is. Peace. Peace out. Little brown boys. Little brown boys.